So it's splash day, finally, it's June, what, 17th? Man, it's a gorgeous, beautiful, sunny day. And it's gonna be light winds, probably 10 miles per hour. So we hooked up the boat and the trailer lights aren't working. So we discovered the ground wire is gone. We're attached down here because I ground it off when I was making the tongue extension. I didn't realize that's what it was for. What about now, the light? Yeah, yeah they're on. Oh, good, yeah. Rock and roll. Can't wait. Michigan City, here we come. Straighten it out. You should, should be good. Getting ready to put up the mast. Just loaded all the gear. All right, so we're going to use my invention today. Adjustable telescoping mast crutch. So, help me and it's just going to go up, and then I'm going to put a pin back in a different hole. Right there. Higher up here. Nope, we're good. I can do it right now if you want to take this off. So I tightened up the backstay because it was a, a little loosey-goosey. It's the first lunch on Ramble On. Ramble On. But we're still in the parking lot. <laughs> we got everything rigged and we got, got all the work done. All the sails on, all the clevises, everything double checked. And now we're gonna splash it in the water very soon. Take three, trying to put the, we just took the screw completely out. Okay, and we gotta go higher. We're on?
man, that's like underwater. Holy crap. I hope it keeps running. Cast off the lines. under the first bridge. All sailboats and deep draft boats must use right channel only. Oh, okay. So that last time I came back on that side. <laughs> oh. Probably the depth issue. Yeah. I was lucky I didn't get stuck. We're heading to Lake Michigan finally after waiting about a, what, an hour, 45 minutes? About an hour now. Waiting for the naval ceremony. The bridge operator was apparently at the Could go up there and go right up, walk over, take a dock. 13 feet here. And we're on the lake. Look at those sand dunes. Awesome. Uh, Mount Baldy. Mount Baldy? Kind of eroded a lot. There's Chicago. Like right behind that boat out there. Oh yeah. See it faintly. We got the whole lake to ourselves. Pretty much. We are rolling. Yes, sir, we're rolling. Just a little bit, a little bit more, just a hair more. Alright, that's good. Finally had the motor off. And we are sailing at last. Day with light winds, probably 10 miles per hour.
lunch time. boat is steering itself. So that means the sails are balanced really well now with the wind. We're on a broad reach. Sailing out. To the middle of Lake Michigan. Well, we're not going to go to the middle. We're not going to go to where we can't see back there. There's a few sailboats way out there. Just cruising along. So this little bungee autopilot I made is working really well on a broad reach. Just sailing right along. All right, this is the best speed we've been going at all day. I'm trying a heave to maneuver. So I got the jib back winded. I'm just letting the main sheet go out. So the heaving to worked. I just got the tiller tied way over down here. The main's loose. It'll probably be harder in rougher weather, but the principle is still the same. Sure. All right, I'm gonna try some fishing now. 61 feet of water for some lake trout or salmon maybe might be out here. You never know where they're at. So I'm gonna try this daredevil spoon first. Let out a ton of line. So I can try to go deeper. Drop the main.
raise it on the quarter and three quarter hours. All right, we're at the end of our voyage for today. It went spectacular. Beautiful smooth sailing day. So we'll see you next episode on Carl's Awesome Adventures. Thanks for watching. See ya.